TOS to Chicago. Our system prioritizes security and safety. Last year, Aiden Pierce launched a terrorist attack on the CTOS, but was ultimately unable to bypass our security measures. With the cooperation of the CPD, Bloom is now offering a $100,000 reward for any information leading to Aiden Pierce. Thank you for your time and your help to make Chicago a safer city. Safety and security in my eyes. Bloom wants to enlist the public in this war. This puts a lot of heat on Pierce, and if they lock onto his trail, well, they'll find mine. I gotta keep an ear to the ground and see if I can keep this under control. number. How did you find me? No such thing as an unlisted number, if you search the right lists. I know where Aiden Pierce has been staying, but I want 10k up front or I walk. I sent you an anonymous account number where you can drop it. Hold on. How can I be sure you've got information worth 10k? Nice talking to you. Goodbye. Wait! Okay, shit. Here. You'd better have something good, or I'll mark it stolen. Oh, it's good. Pierce was living right inside your own house. Some of your employees like to call it the bunker. The bunker? Of course. Be sure to send over the rest of the payment when you see I'm right. Trust me, I can be a real pain in the ass when somebody cheats me. Damn it. I hope Pierce burned his trail. I better get over there and make sure. Here, I got something. Hotel reservations under an alias. He's in St. Louis. St. Louis? Shit. We missed him. Keep digging. I want everything you can find on him. And Ray Kenny. I bet he was living here too. I gotta put a stop to this. First, I'll just slip a bug into her phone. At least if she calls anyone, I'll be the first to know.
Yep, she was hanging out with the vigilante. But it gets worse. Where did they choose to take their honeymoon? The bunker. According to Bad Boy, it's real, and she was even inside. So now, I find myself in a very frustrating situation. I could hand my discovery over to DedSec and gain a metric fuck ton of street cred, or I could cash it in for Bloom's 100k. I used to be all about fight the man and fuck the system, or was it the other way around? Anyway, now I'm starting to think the world is in a perpetual downward spiral no matter what we do. And I sure could use a new car. What to do, what to do? <laughs> Not Aiden. Jesus, what is this? Got himself killed playing dress up. God damn it. Probably shot him before even realizing. <sighs> Bloom's got everybody gunning for Pierce. This is on them. Uh oh. Charlotte's making a call. My contact told me you were working on the Pierce contract. Is this Rosario? One of them. What do you want? I have a potential address in St. Louis. Can you make the trip? I have a fucking car. I can make the fucking trip. Is your money good? I'm with Bloom. My brothers and I, we will get your fucking man. We've got some targets to hit first just to be thorough. One of Pierce's old hideouts got his sister's address. And Dr. Mendez. I don't need to know the details. Need to decommission these bounty hunters before they can do any damage. Gotta get a warning to Aiden. Chances are you dialed this number by mistake. Yes, if so, sir, hang up now. If you're trying to fly me, you're not going to. So hang up now. There won't be a beep. Come on, brother. You ain't making this easy for me. Aiden was living in one of his hideouts. Sounds like the Rosarios may have had a beat on him. I don't know if he's really left town or not, but I'll shut down these assholes. No, 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 I don't want to die.
hold up like ninjas? Ain't no love lost between Aiden and Jackson Shrink. Yolanda Mendez. Hell, Aiden was pretty sure she knew exactly what was going on, but let it happen so she can get her story, sell her book. Still, she doesn't deserve what's headed her way. I need to stop these guys. to find a Nikki Pierce's place. Cops have been through there several times already since she disappeared. Aiden tried to erase her from the system, but it didn't last long. It'll give me a chance to clean up the rest of the Rosarios. trying to call oh now you answer the damn phone i was in the middle of something tricky i couldn't answer 
Yeah, well, I just stopped some angry motherfuckers, bounty hunters, from heading right to your goddamn doorstep. You're welcome. Oh, and DeadSec knows about you and Clara, and they found the bunker. By the way, stay away from the bunker. Charlotte fucking Gardner and Bloom live there now. Okay. Yeah. You have yourself a nice day. Yeah. You too. One of the dates sent this out to the others. High priority. Let's take a look. You need to calm down. I cashed in on my favors to get them here. Don't blow this. You know I deserve this, I- Bad boy runs a big risk here. She told us all about you. Enough for us to come to a decision. Of course. There is only one decision, right? You have no place among the Daves. Wrong. I'm better than any one of you. Test me. Let's do this right now. You have no place within DedSec, either. What the fuck? Do you have any idea what I can do? You can talk. You can pose. But you don't understand. We work anonymously. There is no you in DedSec. Yeah, well, there is a you in DedSuck. Why did you waste our time, bad boy? Default's as good as he says. He just needs to learn when to shut up. You know what? You wasted my time. All of you. 
I give you rinky-dink shit a year, at best. Those are the same days I found in the Ambrose. Looks like this guy's trying to pin the murder on default. Something feels off here. Tech must reboot. It is a shackled army ready to fight. It is the voice of the people, muzzled by its own leaders. That's right. EdSec has leaders, despite their denial. But they would rather stroke their own egos through social media than bring about social change. So blood must be drawn. Every war begins with a tragedy. Somebody's got their panties in a tangle. Aiden told me about dead sex leaders. The Daves. This whack job sounds like he's gunning for them. This guy's dead sack. I'm an eavesdrop. The Daves. Hm. This guy's part of Dead Sex Inner Circle. I don't know what I'll find at the Ambrose, but I have a nasty hunch. I left a tracker on his phone so I can keep tabs on him. These are the same Daves from the Default video. The Ambrose was Default's old haunt, too. Something feels too clean here. I found your friends dead in the Ambrose. Leave me alone. I'm trying to warn you, dipshit. Uh. You guys need to go underground. Mind your own business. Not the reaction I expected. On and up here. Let's check back in with my dead sack pal. Looks like he made a recent call. called a hit in his own people to kill his opposition? I ain't gonna cry over a few black hats. This guy wants to unleash dead sick. And that will be a fucking disaster.
Listen to me, Dave. One of your pals just ordered a hit on you. And this place is about to become the epicenter of a shitstorm. How do you know this? That doesn't matter. No time to talk. Just stay low. His hitman could get here any second. I need to get ready for them. Here they come. You think you can take me on, tough guy, huh? I'm going to hit you from the east. I've got my reasons, and you shits owe me a favor now. A big motherfucker. You remember that. Once we take our proper place, 
once were recognized as the ones who actually made a difference. Who stood defiant against the 1% of bullshit. People will understand why I had to do this. My brothers died for a cause they seem to have forgotten. But that cause lives on and grows stronger.